Is it on? I think it's on. Okay. Hair, it's in my face. Jesus. Oh, no boy though. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Stephanie. Hello. If you're new, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel. To end today's video, I'm going to be doing a product review slash trying out some new products from Selena Gomez um, beauty line called Rare Beauty. I'm super, super excited. This could be like a get ready video because I'm getting ready, right? Yeah. Anyway, so let's just get ready and let's just begin. Put some of my hair clips on. I will link these down below for you guys. I love these things. So in Rare Beauty, I think it first launch back in September. I have a whole video about that so I can link that down below for you guys. Actually on her website right now. So this is her website. Um, pretty much it's called the Stay Vulnerable Collection. Even like her names are just so like inspiring. Stay, uh, Stay Vulnerable Melting Blush. Stay Vulnerable All Over Eyeshadow Brush, which I'm excited to try that one out. Stay Vulnerable Liquid Eyeshadow, which I love liquid eyeshadows. I think they're super convenient for people that are on the go and don't have time to do a full on makeup look, but it's just a very quick oomph look. Vulnerable Glossy Lip Balm. That's one of them. So yeah. Well, I was already there. I'm not gonna lie. I bought some other things too from her collection. Um, I decided to get another brush, her foundation brush. I decided to get another one. I love this brush. I didn't think I was gonna like it as much, and I just like it's become like an everyday routine for me to have this brush because I just like how it's like I can use it for multiple uses for so many things. Oh man, is this stuck? Oh. Honestly, I was just too excited that I just started opening. Sorry! First time trying a few other things. The Melting Blush, this is very popular, it's all over her um, IG, everywhere like that. So this is gonna be one of them. And excuse my nails, excuse them. I know I need to get them done, but I don't get paid until Friday. So we, we waiting here, okay? So this is gonna be the blush, and this is gonna be called Nearly Rose. I think it's so pretty. Just look at this color. I'm so excited to try it. And I just like that it has like a mirror. You see the camera. <laughs> and it's just so cute. I just think it's like so, like you can put this in like your purse and just kind of like a little touch up and go like, ooh. So this is one of the first things that um, I was like really wanted to get from her line. I had to buy the Nearly Mauve. I love anything mauve. Mauve is like my color for everything. I'm like, I love it. So just like, look at that. And again, it's just so cute and compactable. Like so adorable, I love it. The shadow, which I got this one in the Nearly Mauve. I got that one. So here it is. So this is gonna be the lip glossy Bomb, that one, I got us a nearly rose. Cause I feel like I have so many other colors that were very neutral nudes and I just wanted a little bit of pink in my collection since spring is here, spring is coming. Love, when I tell you like I love her liquid lipsticks because they don't feel like it's like suffocating my lip, like I'm dehydrated. It just feels very like lightweight, but it looks matte, it's very different very more like a velvet kind of feel. I got these two colors. So I've been thinking about getting these two colors for seriously for like ever. So I'm like, okay, I got a gift card to Sephora for Christmas and Valentine's Day. So I was like, we are, we're doing this. We're doing this. I got here Courage right here. I got Thrilling. Did I say right? Thrilling? I have like an accent. I'm sorry. Sometimes when I say words, I'm like, it doesn't really come out the way I want it to. So it's going to be more of a true dark brown. I really wanted this color since the fall, but fall is not here anymore. We're definitely like in winter, almost going into spring. That's okay though. That's okay. I was like, why not? Like You guys know from the other video that I did when it first launched, I did get the color 
um, Inspire, which is her signature red look, which is beautiful. And then I also got Brave, which is a beautiful neutral nude. It's just gorgeous. It was perfect for the fall, but even now it's really pretty. So I got these two from the last collection. So this was Courage, and then this one is going to be Thrilling. So, just so I can show you guys the gloss, I like how the wand looks. It just looks so nice. Ooh! <gasps> that's pretty. So that's going to be that one up there. And this one, again, is going to be called Nearly Rose. Got one of her dewy lip balms. I got this one right here. You guys, is the packaging. For I just love how her packaging is for all of her stuff. Even my mom was like, this is just so pretty. I'm like, right? It just looks so like, I don't know. Like, I just love the packaging, too. Um, I got the color Empathy. Here. Ooh. Right there. And again, this is supposed to be very hydrating. It's a very high draining balm so I'm excited to try this one out too so I showed you guys a bunch of the stuff that I got I'm excited and let's just start putting it all in the face okay so since so this is going to be a rare beauty video I have to obviously use the foundation uh, I have definitely like had to change the color again I made it a little darker just because I'm noticing like I don't know it's happening to you guys but like when I go out in the Sun like this part of my face is so dark and then this part is so light because of the mask. I don't know, maybe you don't see it on camera, but I notice it and I'm just like going going through it, going through it. Already prepped and primed my skin. I did the whole nine yards. If you haven't, go ahead and do that. I've been seeing a lot on social media when people are doing that one dot challenge. Guys, I just did the one dot challenge. Like on my phone, so I can put it on my Instagram. Like impressed I was like I was doing so much and I didn't even have to do that much I was like what so not too bad not too bad it's pretty very very impressed very very impressed I also have so just so you guys know my foundation color my foundation color for that is going to be 270 neutral which I believe this is Selena Gomez's color so the next thing I'm going to use is the concealer, and the concealer I have is going to be a 190W. Really right here. So have her concealer brush, so we're just going all in, friends. Step is going to be doing my brows, and I'm going to be using the Rare Beauty, um, the Brow Harmony in Deep Brown. So one thing I really like about this brush or this brow pencil is that it has like two in one. It's like it has this and you can literally brush your hairs. Now we're going to get into the eyeshadow, which I'm excited for. Super, super excited to do. Oh, I think it is too much. Oh well. This feels so creamy. I put chapstick on if you're wondering. Like why is your lips so glossy? <laughs> I put chapstick. <laughs> because my lips are suffering in this Florida heat right now. Put a little more. Like, I don't have to dip in and get more product. That's what I love about her brand. It's just very, like, a little goes a long way. As you can see, oh my god, I ignore my pimple I have up there. Okay, so I put some mascara and everything like that. I bronze a little bit. I put a little something on my, like, the little uh, highlight on my nose because, you know, I'm trying to make it not look so big, but, you know, it's got a big nose. All right, so now for the moment we've been waiting for. So, uh, I've been seeing a lot of people just literally take their brush and just go on like that and they can use also your finger. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a brush one side and then a brush, uh, brush one side and then my fingers on the other side. So, Ooh! Mm. Alright, so a little bit more. 
Ooh, it's very creamy. It's very creamy. Let me just do it like this so you guys can see. That's pretty. I kind of like it more than using my fingers. That's so crazy because usually like I'm a I'm a brush girl forever. Okay, so I blended it out. I think it's so pretty. Definitely, I use my fingers more. I mean, though I love the brush. The brush was beautiful to blend out. Like, just look at that. Oh. Now, we are going to add some highlights. So, let's do it. I'm going to be using the Rare Beauty um, the Liquid Eyeliner. I love this one. I think it's very pigmented super good very black even like the tip is just like it's just awesome i put lower lash mascara on because you already know i need to get some mascara going on up in here so um lastly we're gonna do is put on the lip balm and the stay wonderful lip lip lock lip lock lip glossy lip balm i you know i'll get there Ooh, oh it's so pretty I don't have the best lips, don't judge. And now for the gloss, which I'm so excited to try. <gasps> oh. I like my makeup. I think it looks so like simple, like everyday cute. Like I just like it. So all right, guys, thank you, thank you so, so much for watching my video today. I hope you guys enjoy this get ready with me product review slash, yeah, product review first impression of um, Selena Gomez's Rare Beauty Vulnerable, Stay Vulnerable Collection. Literally love it. Go ahead and get your hands on this product. They're really great. The blush, what I could say was super creamy, super pigmented which I very which I like very much eyeshadow was very pigmented I liked it it was very buildable and then also the lip gloss was just like on top of it and I know this is not part of her collection but I really like the lipsticks that she has they're very very nice so please go ahead thumbs up and subscribe and yeah thank you again for watching this video Blah, thank you <laughs> thank you again for watching this video um, and I'll see you guys next time bye